If you want the best password manager, but finding one amongst all the less secure options like LastPass is just too much of a bother, keep watching. I've done all my research and tested all the strongest providers to come up with three best password managers, which I'm going to review right now. In case you don't know how password managers work, don't worry. I'm gonna be very detailed starting with this NordPass review. This is the password manager that focuses on security and privacy. Not only does it use the latest standards of cryptography to safeguard user data, but it's also created and maintained by a widely known cybersecurity company, NordPass, follows the principles of zero knowledge architecture. To put it simply, NordPass doesn't know anything about you or information you keep in their vaults. Everything is encrypted on your end and NordPass password manager doesn't have decryption keys that are required to read your data even when it's kept on their servers. All those things combined provide a level of privacy that only a few password managers can map. The audits confirm all the privacy promises, making it pretty clear that NordPass follows them to a T. Of course, I've also checked NordPass's history, and unlike disgraced providers like LastPass, NordPass has never suffered a breach or leaked any user data. This honestly makes me feel pretty confident about trusting this password manager. If you want that security for your passwords as well, check the description below. All the best deals from NordPass and other password managers are right there. Just click the link, the discount is already applied. I'm gonna continue this NordPass review by showing you how to navigate it. So I find the user interface very simple to use. The categories and sections are easy to work with. This even applies to mobile devices. I like that NordPass mobile apps are just as functional as desktop apps. There are some providers that fail to keep their apps consistent. So let's say you wanna add your passwords now. What are your options? To begin with, NordPass has no limits on how many passwords, pass keys, or bank card details it can hold. So no need to be frugal. You don't even necessarily have to add them manually. As long as you install the browser extension, because with it, I use NordPass to save passwords automatically after I use them the first time so they get autofilled going forward. Whenever I need to share passwords with someone else, even not a NordPass user, there's a free tool for that on their website. The premium version of the app has it as well, but the website tool is available for everybody. As for the app, it also offers the password generator. It's a feature I use every time I create a new account somewhere to generate a strong password. A lot of multi-factor authentication options as well, my favorite being biometrics. There's nothing more satisfying than being able to use your fingerprint or face recognition to unlock NordPass when you forget the master password. Not that that's ever happened to me. I'm very responsible. <clears throat> One of the recent additions to NordPass basic feature list is passkeys. This is a new standard of authentication. It's bound to replace passwords one day. It's very easy to create a passkey of your own. And after you do, this simple method can get you into your account in one click. Too bad not all websites and services support them yet, but this is just a matter of time. You can use NordPass offline as well, making it more reliable than any of those online only apps, especially when I'm traveling and there's no internet at all. But the best part so far is that all the features I've listed are available in the free version of the app. So not to say that the premium version has nothing to offer because that's where the most valuable features are. Emergency access feature. This is yet another reason that I use NordPass. So my app has way too many important notes, details, files, and passwords. So if something happens to me, I have a person who will receive access to this data. This makes me feel less worried that any of my important info is gonna get lost or become unavailable. Considering that some password managers are removing this feature, I'm glad NordPass sticks to it. Besides emergency contacts, you can use the trusted contacts feature to share any information from your vaults with the person of your choice using a highly secure encrypted connection. The data breach scanner is yet another useful feature. If one of the websites you use leaks your data, it's gonna notify you and prompt you to change your password on that website. Knowing how often that happens, especially with Facebook, I find this feature irreplaceable. So that's a lot of features already, but the password health tool. This is one I can't recommend enough. It points out your weak, frequently used or reused passwords, basically showing you how to make your accounts more secure. This helps a lot because if a hacker finds a password that you use with your email address on one website, they're definitely gonna try using it on other websites. So don't reuse your passwords or just let NordPass fix all that for you. So in case you used a password manager before, NordPass can easily import data from other apps or even from your browser with your permission, of course. So there's 24 seven live chat, customer support if you ever get confused, and that's available to free or paid users alike. And talking about payments, 
NordPass's plans are pretty affordable if you just wanna try them out. There's a money back guarantee in effect. While researching the best password manager options for this video, one provider stuck out because of just how loved it was in the community was 1Password. It was already on my list for a while, but after going in depth, I can confidently say that it's one of the best password managers for sure, especially for families. The reason here, pretty obvious, vaults. Yeah, 1Password login allows you to have a shared family vault containing all the passwords, payment details, and more. But the best part is how easy it is to add family members, share passwords between them, and even maintain custom permissions to avoid kids from meddling with stuff they shouldn't access. You can even configure which information should be available to you when you're traveling with the travel mode. Considering that vaults are accessible on any device with the 1Password app, the family password management becomes much more manageable. 1Password felt really good to use, so I wondered, is it safe to keep all the details in one place for an entire family? That's exactly what I've tested, and I was not disappointed. So 1Password has a great security baseline. All the elements I explained while talking about NordPass are here as well. High-end encryption, audits, privacy standards, and even zero-knowledge architecture. But on top of that, 1Password uses secret key. This is a special 128-bit encryption key that is kept only on your device. Not a single other person has access to it. In terms of features, I like that NordPass and 1Password share all the essentials, autosave and autofill, password generator, and unlimited password storage. But if NordPass includes all those goodies for free, then 1Password is less charitable. It doesn't have a free version. And as I explained in the NordPass part, pass keys are a simple way to log in and eventually you're gonna replace passwords. The app can store documents as well, not only passwords and bank details. And the password health feature checks if your passwords are secure enough. One thing that's missing is emergency access. So instead, 1Password has emergency kit and it's a card with your login data. You can securely store that on your device or send it to a trusted person for an emergency, but it's not as convenient as the proper emergency access feature. So to finish the 1Password review, I wanna cover the user interface. It has a pretty neat and clean and simple design and I liked how it clearly has an emphasis on being accessible and user-friendly. Unfortunately, I can't say the same about their customer support. There's no live chat and you'd have to email them to get help. 1Password costs a bit more than NordPass, but I think it's still rather affordable, especially since you can try it out risk-free with a 14-day free trial. But if you're worried about the monetary side, then you should download RoboForm, perhaps one of the cheapest password manager options. Not only is the pricing low, but there's a free version and a money-back guarantee as well. With the link in the description, you can get a discount to an already affordable price, so feel free to check that out. The best part is that despite being cheaper than competitors, RoboForm Password Manager doesn't lose much in terms of security. The essentials are the same, encryption, audits, and privacy policy. You can expect the same kind of protection as with 1Password and NordPass. RoboForm also offers zero knowledge architecture, so I trust them with my data. Now, when it comes to the user interface, RoboForm on PC feels a little less straightforward compared to the competitors. This is a shame because it has one of the best mobile interfaces that I've seen. It's extremely lean and straightforward. All the features are consistent amongst the apps and you're gonna be able to store any number of passwords and autofill or autosave them on any device. Everything I've mentioned so far is available for free, but it's not that much. If you want a password manager for free with more features such as a password generator, try Bitwarden Password Manager. Just keep in mind that it has a bit of an outdated UI in my opinion, and you'll have to jump a lot between the app and the browser extension to use all the features. It was mildly annoying for me, but hey, it's free. But going back to RoboForm, if you get the premium version, it's gonna grant you a bunch of additional features like the secure sharing, secure file storage, and emergency access. Pass keys, just like with NordPass, are available completely for free. To conclude, what is the best password manager 2024 option for you? If you want security and privacy for your data, NordPass is definitely the pick. It has the best encryption and rocks the zero knowledge architecture. Plus, it has plenty of ways to keep your passwords strong and safe. But if you're planning to use your password manager for a big family, best option would be to use 1Password 
It's about as secure as NordPass, and it's got a lot of features catering to shared use with family members. Finally, if all you need is an affordable password manager for your phone, RoboForm is the perfect option. Its mobile password manager app is the best out there, and the pricing is very low. Plus, you can check my best password manager discounts in the description below to get an even better deal. That's about it. Let me know which password manager is your favorite, and make sure to leave a like and subscribe, and I'll see you in the next one.